Hello guys, today I'm going to talk about the broadcast MAC address. So what is the broadcast MAC address? Uh, you guys uh, must know what is the MAC address. So um, I'm, I'm not going to talk about the MAC address here, but I'm going to talk about the broadcast MAC address. So uh, what, does the, what does the broadcast MAC address look like? So I already uh, 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 type here in the notepad, and you can see this is the every F. I mean, uh, is one, one, one byte. I mean, two, three, four, five, and six. So the every six bytes is going to represent of the F. All right, it's going to be the F, F address like that. So if you keep, if you see this format of the MAC address, this this is the broadcast MAC address. So what does the broadcast MAC address do? So the broadcast MAC address is a kind of special MAC address that is going to 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 tell the switch that. All right, if you if you see if you receive a packet. And you look at the destination MAC address field, and you see that you s you see that f f f f f f something like that. You have to do the broadcast. All right. I mean that when the switch receive the packet and it look at into the destination field, when you see the broadcast MAC address, please do the broadcast. That is the meaning of the broadcast uh, MAC address. So I'm going to demo you in the lab here, or uh, as you can see that. The, the 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 laptop here doesn't know any everything. I mean, doesn't know anything about the a, uh, MAC address of the remote laptop. So I'm going to show you ARP uh, uh, hyphen A. It has no table entry of the ARP. So I'm going to ping to ten zero zero two here. All right. It's going to generate the ARP, and then when I open this message, you, you as you can, as you guys can see that uh, we got two kind of MAC address. The first one is the source MAC address, it's a 007E2, uh, I'm sorry, is EC1D042A, it is the MAC address of the laptop one. And you can see the destination MAC address is the FFFFFF, something like that. Alright, and this packet is going to send to the switch. Alright, what does the switch do? And then I'm going to forward it. Where this, this packet is going to the switch here. Alright, uh, when I open again, alright. The switch, the switch is going to see to see this this MAC address is the F F F F F something like that, and then what it's going to do is that it's going to forward every packet to the port F zero two, F zero three, and F zero slash four something like that. So, <coughs> uh, you you guys can see the simulator here. So when I forward it, the switch when they see the, the broadcast MAC address, it's going to do the broadcast uh, of that packet to everybody else. You can see it's going to broadcast to everybody else. Okay, so. Uh, you can see that the, uh, that this guy dropped the packet, and this guy also dropped the packet. Only the laptop too uh, accept the packet. Okay, accept the packet. Why? Because the packet uh, is belong to him, and this guy has no uh, 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 relationship with this packet, so he just drop it. Okay. Okay. That uh, the process is going to send back uh, to the laptop once something like that. But the main reason I just want to to, to tell you that. When the uh, when the switch receives the broadcast MAC address, it's going to do the broadcast to everybody else. So, the switch, I'm sorry, the MAC address, uh, the broadcast MAC address is going to have the format like this. Uh, is this in there? Uh, F F F F F F something like that. All right. So, when you, when next time when uh, people say, all right, uh, uh, what is the broadcast MAC address and what does the broadcast MAC address do? So you guys uh, can answer to them like uh, I I have, I can show you in the lab right here, all right. So uh, that's it for this video. I um, I hope you guys enjoyed this and thank you very much.